Hi guys, so I'm in my apartment today because it's raining outside. So today is April 28th, 2014, and it's been officially 15 days since I placed my order with Zoe to make my samples. And I have to say, it's been a long 15 days. Um, you know, last week, and I was kind of wishing that she would send them early, but she didn't. Um, she sent them right on the day that she told me she would, so, but that's fine. Um, I woke up this morning um, and I was pleasantly surprised to see an email from Zoe and in the email I have an iPhone so I scrolled down and in the email um, Zoe um, had sent, she attached um, all of my four styles of sandals and they look awesome. I was like whoa it was like Christmas day I couldn't believe it. The workmanship on the sandals are awesome um, you know there's no glue hanging in between like the the footbed and then the sole like you know um, that's how you can tell a good workmanship is that everything looks um, proper and it looks like a really decent well-made shoe um, all of the fabric that I picked out look great I absolutely love the fabrics mm, excuse me and so I'm really happy um, I don't have any complaints the only thing I would say is that there's no stitching on the footbed of the sandals and um, I didn't catch that before when I when I got the first samples um, so anyway um, I'm but I'm gonna go forward and I'm gonna take these samples I'm gonna you know sell them but when I place my final order for stores um, I'm gonna ask them to add like a stitching on the footbed I think that that will make it I think that will give the shoe um, something a little extra that I think it needs that they need but other than that I mean I'm really happy I'm really proud of them I can't wait to um, see them in person I'm right now which I will receive tomorrow I'm waiting to see how much how much per pair the sandals are hopefully they won't be too much I know that she used um, PU material which I don't love PU but it is cheaper and it doesn't look cheap so um, so um, the price per pair shouldn't be too much it can, shouldn't be too expensive um, and then she's going to send me pictures of hangers because I want to hang the sandals um, so I can hang them like um, store owners can hang the sandals on the wall and it won't take up too much space. Um, so we'll see about that tomorrow. And then my one sheet is pretty much done. I just have to figure out like just like the numbers and the cost and, and how much everything um, will end up being in the end. And then I just plug it into my... Um, one sheet and then I'm done so and then I can go out there and start my next journey I, I was I felt like I was in the tunnel and now I see the, I finally see the light and I'm like out of the tunnel and now I'm going into a new tunnel um, and that's the tunnel of selling 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 and who knows when I'll see the light at the end of that tunnel I, the light at the end of that tunnel is definitely money and um, so anyway I'm nowhere near there so I'm you know it's I'm starting to get into a new tunnel with that but anyway, like I said, I'm really happy. I'm excited to put the sandals on the website. I'm not going to do that quite yet. I'm not going to put the pictures up until um, I have the sandals in my hands. And I'm going forward and like um, probably um, selling the sandals or at least talking to store owners here in the Richmond area. Then I'll put them online. Um, but I'm not going to do it yet. I'm not going to debut them yet. I don't want to rush and put them out there. And, and then if anybody wants to contact me to buy them, I'm, I don't have any sandals um, I don't have like a bulk order or anything that would that wouldn't be too great so I don't want to go that route mm. but I do um, but like I said um, I'm going to continue I'm not gonna put them up but I will um, talk about them and anyway so that's that I'm excited to, for where I'm at now and um, hopefully I'll have some more great great stuff to talk about next week thanks